For many years, scoffers at the Word of God said that several Bible characters are found nowhere except for in the Bible, meaning to say that there is no evidence of their existence in history or archaeology. They listed among several others, such persons as Kings David and Herod. But excavations in 1993 at the northernmost biblical city of Tel Dan uncovered an inscription in three pieces. The campaign account by an Armenian king mentioned for the first time the house of Israel and the house of David. Clearly a reference to the southern kingdom of Judah and Israel's famous king. David not only existed, but he was remembered over a century later as the founder of a great dynasty. Archaeologists have excavated Herod the Great's luxurious palaces at Caesarea Maritima, Herodium and Masada and other sites. In 1996, biblical archaeologist Dr. Michael Hazel excavated at Masada an imported fragment of a wine amphora or a jug. On the fragment was an inscription Regi Herodi Ludaiko for Herod King of Judea. It was the first mention of Herod the Great's title outside of the New Testament, found in an archaeological context. <laughs> Fake characters, you say? They are not in the Bible. Think again. As the discoveries by archaeology continue to confirm over and over again the veracity of the Bible, the Word of God. Thanks for joining me today. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button. And while you're at it, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. And I'll see you next time as we go into the Bible verse.